hi everybody and welcome back to my youtube video right now we are in the car and we are on our way to the dollar tree so i decided that today i wanted to take you guys with me on a dollar tree hunt for spring and easter decorations for the house so i can show you all the findings and everything that i come up with only from the dollar tree i decided this year to only go to the dollar tree for decorations so let's go with me if you follow me on instagram then you probably know that um for me it's super big to decorate the house for every season for every festivity there is so i am super excited about this one um today is saturday so carlos is off so we are having a family day and now i'm gonna sneak in the dollar tree with the baby naps in the car because we don't want to take her down and then i'm gonna find some goodies hopefully hopefully i found good ones um i'm not so familiar with this dollar tree it's still it's by my house but i don't come to this one often i go to one that it's a little farther away from home but this one would have to do today let's see how it goes so look who's awake from her nap you excited for the dollar tree Say hi. Up. Oh. Up. Oh. Ah, this is when you enter this way. You see, I love this bag. This is super, super cute. It's for the outside. Ice cream. We came to a Colombian place to have her favorite ice cream and some Colombian goodies. <laughs> ice cream. Where are you? my spring and Easter decoration this Friday night and the reason why I say Friday night is because I actually bought the thing last Saturday so yes almost a weekend apart I know I said I was gonna do it sooner um, I said I was gonna do it the following day or that same night but mom life it happens you guys understand me so before I get to that I'm just going to make myself um, a little fiber do something I drink every night um, if you want to know more information about it, you can always go to my Instagram. I leave here my Instagram so you can go check it out. But yes, but I'm excited to put up the decoration this week. Honestly, I've been saying every day. I've been setting it up everything on the table and I've been saying like, okay, today I'm going to do the video. Today I'm going to put up the spring decoration every single day i said that on sunday on monday on tuesday on wednesday on thursday and finally i'm doing it today friday which i'm super excited 
I don't know if I mentioned it before when I went to the Dollar Tree, but I'm not very big when it comes to Easter, when it comes to decorating the house, but I always like to add like a little touch here and there, only because I like to do that for every single holiday or festivity that we have. Let me get a spoon, I'll be right back. Okay, and I'm back. So, um, so yeah, so let's get started. Let me take my drink with me. And first, I want to show you what I got at the Dollar Tree, everything that I found. I couldn't find much, but I did find a few things that I really liked. So I want to show you, let's go. Okay, so let me show you a few things that I have from last year. I threw most of it away because but I still um, have this. I also have a light pink one, which I put it outside in the porch. I'll show you guys. But I thought they were really cute. And I don't know if I'm supposed to put this in a pot or something, but I don't know why I love it. It's just like this. I feel like it makes it look like more of a decoration. And I also have this sign that I'll be using, I don't know where, I think this, I'm going to cut it and then just leave this part instead of having the whole thing. This is easy to hang, but I always found that a little annoying how you would always like move around. So I think I'm just going to cut this off and use this for something else. So let's see what I end up doing with this. Now let me show you what I found at the Dollar Tree. What I I show you the receipt, I only spent $20 and only $15 on decoration because honestly, um, I only found these things and I was not about to spend a lot and you always find really good cheap things at the Dollar Tree. Okay, so I bought these flowers which I thought they were gorgeous. They, were, they look so pretty at least to me and for a dollar each I think that they are fantastic look at this they also had this one like in a light lilac lilac how do you say in a light purple <laughs> they were really 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 pretty uh, but purple is not my color when it comes to decoration I know I'm supposed to add a little bit more color for spring but I just thought that these ones were super pretty and the yellow gives it like that little pop so yes, so I'll definitely be using this. Oh, and how cute it goes well with this. Okay, so I'll be using this. Let's see what else I found. Okay, and I thought that this was really pretty because we cannot forget what this is about. I thought this was really pretty for a dollar. I really, really, really liked it. And I thought that these little stuffed animals, I'm not a huge fan of stuffed animals, but I thought they were super adorable. And I think that they'll go super cute, like in the table centerpiece or in the decoration I have in the counter. So we'll see, we'll see what I end up doing with this. Let's see. Okay, you got these cute little eggs. I think that they are so adorable. Fun fact, I do not like to put up for the creation those colorful eggs. Even though they had really pretty ones, they were colorful but not as bad or as bright. They were very pastel, very light. So I really like them but I'll probably use that for the baby's basket. But look at how cute and I'll probably show you guys how I make the baby basket. Um, I'll be making one for my baby and I'll be making a few for her cousin. How pretty, I love the that it was all white. So I'll be using this for decoration around. Oh, and I also found this small candle and I wanted to get it because I have candles everywhere and I thought that the color, it went with the decoration, so I'll see where I'll put it. Okay, and this little sign, It says um, spring bunny at welcome, but I have no idea what I'll be doing with them or where I'll be putting them. Um, so this shall be interesting. Let's see. Oh, and last but not least, like this is Happy Easter. Again, I love that it's like very soft color. It's not as bright. So I really, really, really loved it. 
So that is it. That is all I found at the Dollar Tree. So let me get ready and let's start putting small decorations around the house. Again, I'm not going all out. I'll probably put a few here in the um, table centerpiece. I'll probably put some in the counter and on my shelves. So let's see. Okay, so let's start decorating. Let's go. This ones that I had from last year, I added them here just to add like a little touch. Perfect. I had completely forgotten about this area, so I added the flower from last year and then I added this new one here. Just something simple. Okay, so here's the table centerpiece. I love what it says there. Pray often. Okay, so I added these flowers here. I love how I put it with this small because it's one of my favorite ones. So I added a stuffed animal here, the little eggs, and then a few eggs here as well, and the little blessed. Okay, so I feel like this is one of my favorite corners ever. You guys see, I added the bunny sign and the spring i threw away the other one because it said welcome really not needed and i added the flowers there Okay, that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for tuning in. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and you guys like the decoration. Again, I don't go all out when it comes to spring or Easter um, to decorate the house. I do it mostly because of the baby that was. Like I was saying, that's why I went with the more playful, more with the stuffed animals and the little eggs. Um, I wanted to go with that style because of her. I actually got this idea of somebody on Pinterest. So I liked it. I really hope you guys liked it. And if you decide to do it, let me know in the comments below. And if you don't like it, let me know as well. But Again, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And stay tuned for the next video.